All right, we're back with more Luigi's Mansion 3. Hey, Robin! I don't understand why it asks you that. Like, clearly, on that account, I don't know why it prompts me there. Uh, all right, let's get back into it. So we had just finished, I think it was the eighth floor that we, maybe the seventh floor? Uh, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, which I think includes the basement. So yeah, so eighth floor probably there. Hold on. Uh, yeah, okay, whatever. 
I guess I could have also just waited like one second and then as soon as I'm in the game here, I'll, I'll be able to see what floor I'm on. <laughs> um, so after the stream yesterday, just as a, as a, uh, getting into stuff, um, I talked about it on Twitter, but I managed to figure out the complete list of like, okay, yeah, so this is the eighth floor. Found the complete list of like all the item locations in the Majora's Math Grand Miser by looking at a spoiler log, not for not for uh, the the run that I'm doing, but I generated a new one and uh, wait, what? Shit, what happened last time? Uh, I generated a new one and um, didn't we get a new button? Or did it get taken? Oh, did it get taken? Oh, fuck. Now, I don't remember what the hell was happening. Hey, Emily. Oh, that's right. Where's this cat? Um, but yeah, I generated a new spoiler log and, uh, and got the whole list of all the locations. And then I also realized there actually is a version of the tracker available that has all the proper item locations. So... We should be on track. There's lots of, there's actually a, a good number of places we can still go in Majora's Mask. So I think we're, we're in a bit better position than where we were at the start. I wish I had been using this other tracker from the start though. Oh, hold on. I, I thought that thing was wiggling because it was plot relevant, but I think it's just wiggling because the physics are fucked. Um, Oh wait, I can use the, yeah. It's just realizing, yeah, you can use the dark light to um, mm -hmm. see where ghosts went. Yeah. Fuck that guy. Oh, there's all sorts of tiny ones over here as well. I think my game is a smidge lag. Uh oh. Just need to turn the volume down because it just seemed like a bit much. Ow, fuck you. I'm trying to actually flash that guy first. Get him, get him. Get this cowboy hat, dude. Still one more dude around over here, the guy with the cowboy hat. What? His cowboy hat protects him? Oh, I see. It's over his eyes. Wait, what? I can't suck it off his head? Do I have to, like, knock it off his head? God damn it. Oh, there we go. The fuck? Um, ground pound. There we go. Toad a mini cowboy hat. I mean, he's already basically wearing a hat. Does he need another one? Okay, so now we need to figure out where this stupid purple cat went. Apparently it went in here. Gotcha. Oh shit. Okay. Do I have to get up? Oh, I see. I can get up there over this way. Nope. Oh, yeah, I can. Okay, never mind. Seemed like, seemed like it wasn't letting me onto this. Uh... What the fuck? Oh man, perspective is wonky as hell here. Except also, I don't think this is where I was meant to go. Now maybe I can go into that building. What the fuck? Okay, there we go. Yeah, these, these sec, why can I not go down this ladder? These sections with the like fixed camera, which I guess is a lot of the game. Why can I, seriously, why can I not go down that ladder? 
Am I not understanding where that ladder is? Oh, I see. They suck. I, I hate having the fixed camera angle. Like, that's way too far away to... Why would they not put that at the edge? You don't have the perspective to see what is happening there. Uh... Oh, okay. What? What? So, it jumped down when I... Okay, and now it's up there. I, I really don't understand. Oh, is it just that it jumps when I'm, like, not looking at it? But, like, in its... Okay, how do I... Do I just need to suck as soon as it... As soon as it jumps down? What the fuck? No, okay. Which makes sense, because that's not how this game works. Do I maybe need to have a... Maybe I need to use the dark light? Okay. So what am I... Do I... Okay, that maybe maybe I need to lure it somewhere. Lure it away. Maybe I need to lure it out of this area. Okay, so that didn't work. Maybe, okay, I What happens if I just literally there we go. Cat abuse. I tore off one of its tails. Okay, so now I guess that means I need to do this probably two more times. That was weird. Like, I don't know. I guess I figured it out, but like... Hey, Doc. Needs more Mario. But yeah, like, I guess I figured it out, but I don't know. That fight just seemed weird and kind of, like, unintuitive. Okay, so now we've got cat. No, never mind. All right, cat's gonna go into what? A different floor, I guess. Oh, uh, do I seriously? Oh my god, the physics are so fucked up in this game. <laughs> Holy shit. Um. So I guess we need to go down to the seventh floor now. Because he went through the floor. That's what I assume. Oh, there's a door there. I don't know. The fixed camera angle. Like, I guess they're not totally fixed, but. Wait, what? What? The camera angles in this game are weird. 
Oh, I see. Wait, do I just need to suck this boy? No. Oh wait, maybe I need to, I probably need to suction cup him. How do I do that? There we go. I forgot about that ability. Uh, wait, what? Ground pound? Fuck! Um, but yeah, the, the camera angles are just, I don't know, they, they don't feel like they work great a lot of the time. What the fuck am I supposed to do once he's knocked over? Oh, maybe that's when I'm supposed to dark light him. Okay, yeah, there we go. It feels like they kind of like, I don't know, that didn't, again, also didn't seem particularly intuitive, but I guess I did manage to intuit. All right, so yeah, I guess we still have to go down a floor. Did I? I did go in there. Yeah, I went in there as Guigi and did that. All right. Um, oh motherfucker! Ow! Come on. Also, there's a second guy who is. Oh what? Okay, I figured I would need to like stop him from using that flashlight. Beat up this other guy using the other guy's body. All right, now we go down to the seventh floor, presumably. There we go, seventh floor. Oh, which is the garden suites? Isn't that the Venus flytrap floor? Which was like a huge area? Whoa, hold on. Oh, what? There's literally just... Invi... Uh, wait. What? Oh, I see. My perspective was not correct there. Literally just invisible gems. Uh, oh, there we go. Okay, so I guess we'll just keep shining the dark light around. That seemed kind of, kind of fuck you-ish, just having that there just... I don't think there was any hint that it was there in terms of like. Uh, I think it must be yours. I'm not hearing any disconnect sound. Just a second. Yeah, my headphones are unplugged, so I should be able to hear it if it was happening. Doo -doo -doo. Doo -doo -doo. Doo -doo -doo. Okay, here we go. Did it fucking go down? No, no, it didn't. Okay. For a second, I thought it went down another floor. One thing I discovered, well, I kind of had half figured it out the other day, but then uh, fully figured it out today. For some reason, the uh, Ethernet adapter that I got for my Switch stopped working at some point. Like, it's it's not able to connect to the network anymore. And then when I went and looked at the reviews for it on uh, Amazon, because I bought it, like, maybe a year ago, um, it's weird, because, like, there's other people who were like, 
yeah, it stopped working like after a couple months. Which is really weird. It's like it must it must just overheat or something and and die. So I've had to order a, a different one because it's a weird sound that I just heard. Um, because I much vastly prefer having a a wired network connection over a, a wireless one. Weird how stuff like that sometimes just arbitrary fa arbitrarily fails because it's like shitty manufacturing or whatever. Okay, went in here. Oh, this is the room that I absolutely shredded with the chainsaw. Yeah, all this stuff grew back. Uh, I can't really tell if it. It must have gone through the wall there, but. Wait, where's the chainsaw in here? Oh wait, was it back here? This was definitely the room with the chainsaw. Are you telling me no more? And by chainsaw, I mean circular saw, but. Oh, probably in here, maybe? Yep, there we go. Fuck all this stuff. Also, are you in here? Oh, I probably need to suction cup. I don't see any tracks of where this thing went. Although interesting that I can see the area underneath here when I shine the dark light down there. I guess I can sort of see it here as well. Uh, all right, let's go down there or up there. Okay, that's weird. Oh, okay. That was a star. There we go. Oh. Ow. Okay, so I presumably need to do the same thing again. Tail gone. All right. How much do you want to bet it's gonna drop down to the next floor down now as well? Oh, okay. I was honestly expecting it. Oh, it just went back up. Did it go back up or did it go... I probably just went to the next floor up in this area. I don't think it went back up to the eighth floor, I don't think. Oh shit, I didn't only just noticed those spiders. Oh, and a money spider. Gotta love it. Uh, okay, so yeah, I suspect it's just in here. Oh, this is the room that had the, wait, what the fuck? Ow, fuck it, fuck. Oh, I see, I have to. Oh, come on. There we go. Uh, okay. 
I didn't get anything from that. That's weird. What I do get, though, is the satisfaction of just tearing everything apart in this room. Fuck this table. Fuck this chair. Fuck all this grass. Fuck this wardrobe. Wait, what is that in the side even? Is that a Gooigi path? Oh no, there was that's where the um, that big vine came through the wall. Also, I presumably don't even need to do this, because this isn't even the room that was above the one where the cat went. Okay. I'll just quickly cut through this bed for good measure, and then... Uh... Fuck all this. Just leave that running on the floor. So yeah, this is the room. Yeah, you can see it right there. Now, was there... Was there a path for me to get into that tub? Double Ouija scenario here. Wait, what? Okay. I did that once and it cracked the edge of the tub. Wait, can I do that? Oh, no, never mind. I was thinking I'd be able to maybe throw Ouija around. Uh, I don't have any more stuff with which to, uh, <laughs> poor Luigi is weird. He's just kind of in a trance. Oh, maybe I can... to it sounds like it's trying to like tell me something here but ow fuck okay so was I unintentionally oh yeah okay there is a floor crate It was making a noise over on the right side there and a flash as though I was doing something correctly over there. But apparently I was not. That was just an unrelated sound. Establishes that pipe. Let's 
so what? Oh, does that mean that I can now... What the fuck? That's weird. Okay, I, th I think that does mean that I can now... Okay. I feel like that should work either direction, but whatever. I'm boiling the cat out of the... Out of the tub. Ow, fuck. Oh, shit. What's the... Here we go, last tail. Always tear your cat's tails off. Highly recommended. Weird that I didn't actually catch that cat. I just got it down to one health. Tore off all his tails, got it down to one health. And then it just disappeared. All right, can I jump? Is there anywhere that I can just drop down and not have to walk all the way back? That'd be ideal. Gotta be somewhere. Maybe here, nope. Game says fuck you. You're not saving any time. Oh, maybe if I fuck this up. Oh, god damn it! I mean, I guess that would be pretty punishing if you had to actually restart this whole thing when you fucked that up the first time going through here, but... <laughs> In this case, where I'm trying to go back down, that's just annoying. Uh, okay... Ooh. Oh yeah, should I be just dark lighting all the way along in here? <laughs> Fuck off, bats! Oh, do I? okay. I don't like these scenarios in which you get like entirely surrounded and you have to use Gooigi to like untrap yourself. Also weird, I find it weird. Sometimes it seems like he just gives you hearts because it's like, okay, you got hurt. You probably want a heart now, don't you? Like, it doesn't even seem like there's a reason for it to have given you the heart. It just kind of does. So, where? I don't know. Whatever. I feel like there's some sort of weird adaptive difficulty thing going on in this game. Oh, yeah. Luigi can have a little uh, heart as a treat. Yeah. Oh yeah! Alright, Unnatural History Museum. Looks like a pretty basic floor. I love... I love when you just get a bunch of the same line repeatedly back to back. That's my favorite. Fuck these flowers. Dinos. Wait a minute, okay. 
Seeker collect. All right, unintentionally found a secret. I did it. <laughs> I did it. That's kind of obvious there. Ow, fuck, are you kidding me? My reward was a bunch of bats? Wait, also, hold on. Oh, I guess it hatched? Okay, fuck that. Okay, that's wiggling, so I... something like that. No, I don't know. Whatever. Uh, let's check the other side, because it looks like this is a relatively small area, so I'm just trying to make sure I'm checking every little nook and cranny here. So this pterodactyl up on the ceiling. Nope, can't do anything with that. Okay, there's Gotta be a missing ball in there, right? Like, yeah. boom, boom. Leave no dollar behind. Fuck this flower. I think it's regrowing. No, I guess not. Ooh, flashable thing, though. Ooh, secret. Safe. Also, big-ass pile of cash in that display there. And a gem. I feel like I've probably gotten, like, about half of all the gems so far. I'm honestly not sure what my kind of collection rate is being on those. Go along the sides. Wait, is that a whole missing thing? No. There, so that's openable. There's one of our gems. So at some point we're clearly going to do something that will let me open these display cases. Or break them or something. Because there's like all sorts of stuff in these display cases. Ow. I guess I could flash these guys. Yeah, I think that's all of them. Oh, maybe not quite. Sometimes you just gotta flash the birds. I think there's one more? Yeah. Alright, how about on this side? Fuck these flowers. Okay. Let's head on in behind the curtain. I assume I need both of them to do this simultaneously. It's a T-Rex! Wait, it's moving. Because <laughs> it moved after the flash. Yup. Alright, so that T-Rex is going to be ghost infested.
Oh. Check the other side of the room just in case, but I have a feeling. Oh, I guess there's there's another toad. So, yeah, this is a this is a boss fight. All right, let's bring try and bring Toad back to life first. Okay, I'm a little surprised I was able to do that. Okay, <laughs> never mind. Didn't feel like that's how the boss fight was gonna start. And Toad is dead because his painting, in which his soul has been trapped, has been destroyed. That Toad is officially dead. Okay, so how does this... Okay, I can only go this far. I've got eggs. Ow. Got eggs that I can feed him. I have a feeling I need to get an egg in his mouth and then I shoot him in the belly with the other one. There we go. Okay, so now we only have one egg source. Ow, fuck. Okay. Nice. I mean, I can do that now. There's... Okay, so I need to figure out... How I can... Like, when I can... Shoot him that... That didn't work. You can go up to him. Hey, Jade, how's it going? Like, as far as I know... Get another. Oh, okay. It kicks me if I go too close. Okay, so what's the what's the trick here? What ability do I have that I'm not thinking of? Oops, shit, that's not not what I meant to do. Um, I can seriously, not get that heart that's in there. I shoot that into his mouth, that's gonna... Cause like, I assume that this is sort of... Do I need to flash the... Okay, no, maybe I need to dark light it? that I am not supposed to walk up close like that. What was that noise? Oh, is that a low health noise? Ow, fuck, I forgot about that. But 
But then there, they're just like, yeah. Have little a heart as a treat. Right, let's do the T-Rex, yeah. Um... Is this a Gooigi kind of scenario that I'm not? I don't know what Gooigi would... do for me here. Ow, fuck, I got rocked by the egg. Nope. Oh. Oh, okay. Yeah, it, it that's a good that is a good point. It, it is this is sort of a yeah, this is very fairly ow. Fuck. Kind of similar to a one of the a boss fight from one of those Lego games. They are super generous with the uh hearts though. Okay, eat me. But then there's more, yeah, there's more puzzles and stuff between the boss fights. This boss fight is definitely like a Lego boss fight. But I guess even in between, yeah, it, it is It is sort of like the Lego games. Okay, so now we have no eggs. Although there are those chunks of dino on the floor there that may be usable. Fuck. Okay, yeah, so these are usable things. Do I need to do the same? Oh, okay. Literally just... Oh, alright. Gotcha. Oh, and each time I do that, it drops a... I don't want to go over there close to the boss. Oh, and the... I need to lure it over this way. Fuck off! Holy shit. Yeah, all the, like, hearts are spawning, like... near where it is, because it's from smashing things. Alright. Weird. That last phase was, like, way easier than the rest of it. It's a fucking caveman ghost. Like, that was just a regular boss fight after the thing that seemed like a Lego boss fight. Okay, so now we just got Caveman. Oh, except he does, like, AoE attacks. Ow, fuck. Oh, okay, he uses that to block his face. Oh, shit, I- oh, okay. See how long we can hold on to him here. Oh, it's okay. Yeah, yeah. At a certain point, it seems like he stops. You can't. Uh... Oh shit! Too early again. At a certain point, like you stop being doing like drag damage. So yeah, I might as well like try and maximize. Okay, so now I slam him. So I'm not doing any more damage just from dragging him around. Nice. Oh shit. Ow. I missed my opportunity there. I went too far away that time. I need to just like get relatively close to him when he's about to do the big attack. 
You don't need to actually be that far away. This time there's no reason to wait. Fucking kidding me. What? God damn it. I guess we gotta do that boss fight again. This game is kind of buggy. That's not the first time it's crashed. Because it crashed pretty early on, I think. I would say, if anything, I would say... I don't know that I ever had a game crash on the Wii U. I've had a lot of games crash on Switch. Like... Multiple games I've encountered crashes on, which is kind of disappointing. Also similar to a Lego game. Also sad because this is like a first party game. At least I know how to do this, so this shouldn't even take that long, but... Can I skip this? Nope. Okay. Couldn't remember if it was in this game where I unintentionally saw the skip cutscene button. Evidently not. Or, well, maybe it was. Maybe you just can't skip this cutscene. <coughs> I wonder if I can do the Guiji thing even in the first phase of this fight. No, maybe not. Okay. First stage done. We've only got one. Oh, fuck off. Okay, stage two, done. Now we're on to free roam mode. Alright. So now we just need to let him break some dinos here. Oh, okay, here we go. Fuck off, please. Ow. Okay. Got one hit. Two hits. Rear up, I dare you. Three hits. <laughs> Grab this heart over here just for good measure. Gotcha. Okay, now we're back in caveman. Yeah, that went really fucking fast now that I understand that understood how this uh, fight goes. No, no, this should be this should be trivial again because this wasn't hard either. Hopefully, it just doesn't crash again. If it just keeps crashing here, that's gonna suck. Okay, there we go. 
Oh, shit, I shouldn't have started doing that, but whatever. I meant to drag him for a little bit longer there. Okay, here comes the big slam. Where is it? There we go. Right. Drag this guy. Really show him what we think. Okay, one more cycle here. This guy's gonna get fucking ratioed. No crash this time. Yet. And it's safe. Perfect. So even if it did crash, it doesn't matter. Alright, so that is presumably that entire floor done. So I was looking at how long to beat... Or, well, not actually. I wasn't looking at how long to beat... I guess I did end up looking at that, but I was looking to see how long this game was. Apparently it's like 15 to 20 hours, so we're probably, honestly, well, I guess, I don't know. But I, th I think I saw 15 to 20 hours, but then how long to beat was kind of like 12 to 20 hours. Um, oh, B2, interesting. Uh... So I have a feeling we're actually going to be closing in on that 12-hour kind of end point. Ah, you've managed to save another Toad! Excellent! Show Toad to the elevator. I'll make sure he stays safe and sound in the lab. Unless there's like a whole, bu whole bunch more after after you get to all of the floors. But I kind of doubt that. And I mean, I'm not saying that's bad. That's like, that's still a decent length of game thinking we are actually getting close to the end of this. Can I seriously not? Oh wait, hold on, maybe... Are there any dino chunks left in here that I could use to... Yeah, okay, here we go. That's definitely what this is for. Oh wait! I also didn't try um, putting suction cups on those glass things and just pulling them off. Nope, oh, that'll do it. Get fucked. Hold on a second, uh, Toad. We're gonna vandalize this museum real fast. I already wrecked all the dinosaurs. Might as well break everything else as well and just claim it as a as ghost damages. Still a few more display cabinets here. Okay, yeah, I was wondering. There was an invisible thing there, so... Or an empty... Empty, uh... Fuck. Empty display thing. Makes sense that there was another gem there. So there's still two more gems in this area. Because there's, like, six per floor. Oh wait, is that? Oh no, that's just a thing. Hey cats, cats forever X X. How's it going? Uh, okay, might be one in that pot there. Oh yeah, that's uh, one of these crystalline ghosts.
back. Oh, you motherfucker. Where'd he go? Where did he go? There he is. <laughs> Come on. There we go. Alright, so that's another one. Only one more in here. Maybe we should just have a quick look around and see if I can... Toad's just gonna have to deal with it. I'm busy busting ghosts. We've only got one more in here, so like... We've already gotten this. Is there anything else we can... Oh, fuck out of here, Toad. Oh, we could break that. There we go. All right. Collected all the museum gems. I wonder if I could have broken that with Toad's head. Eh, whatever. Bye -bye. All right. So that's that Toad rescued. Oh yeah, and that's her cat. Yeah. All right, dispatching more ghosts to deal with us. Ah, oh, then, Luigi, you still need to find one more Toad, Princess Peach, and Mario. We're halfway there. Good luck. <laughs> bye bye. All right, so. I can just go straight to the lab, but let's go install the button and might as well put the button in the elevator and then go to the lab from there, I guess. So I guess we're going down to the basement anyway. Boiler works. Yeah, let's pop down just to the uh, to the lab. Anyway. Mario, 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 Mario. Mario, Mario. Oh, thank you for the follow cats forever X. Um, yeah, so we already got that one. I want to hold on. I want to go back over here because there's still that gem that I wasn't able to get to over here before. Oh, was there maybe a? Great or something that I can like slip down as Gooigi up here. Oh yeah, there is. Welcome back, Emily. How many things do I have down here? Only three. Okay. We already got something over here. Burgies. I know there was one in the, uh... In the, um, like, electrical room over here. I don't think I was able to get that one out last time I checked. Although maybe I can only do this after I've done something down in the 
boil. Oh shit, nope. Down the boiler works. Oh. Gotta pop that. Flash that. There we go. Okay. It's possible there's one over by his car also. Also possible there's some horse shit one around here somewhere. Okay. That one's basically just free. Okay. Seems suspicious. Unceremoniously dumped up there. Hmm. Okay, what about this one? Uh, oh no, never mind. I just didn't have the right angle. Uh. Ow! Fuck! All right, we got a gold boy up there that I missed. It looks like. Got a black lightable thing. Higher in the elevator shaft. There we go. There's our. There's our last gem, and it looks like I maybe just need to drop down through as Guiji. There we go. We got all the basement gems now. back down uh i guess we never actually went into the lab which is why i had partially partially why i'd come down here uh because i there's got to be something for me to spend my spend my cash on Bone. I mean, I guess there's gem finders. I almost have enough to buy all of them. There's also the boo finders. I feel like though, like the gems aren't that hard to find. I wonder if there's. Well, I don't know. Whatever. Also, I wonder if, because like there's 29 of them, which I feel like is the same number that there were when I first looked. But maybe that I've just, maybe I've just had like consistency in finding the same number. I don't remember. And so it's been like, okay, there's six more, but I got half of them or whatever. No, I can't. Can't interact with that. Uh. Oh, yeah, okay, so I got all the jewels, so we don't need to worry about being here. Let's head on down to the boiler works. Love that it takes as long to go to the, the next basement down as it does to come from the ninth floor. There's 
banjo playing ghost down here? There's also lots of rubber ducks down here. Ah, fuck! Okay, I got a... Got a Gooigi. Alright, what's actually- oh, I can't just go in there? Okay, that was literally just a trap. Oh wait, or are there coins? Right, so that's all that stuff. Back this way. This these seem like there's probably something behind this elevator even. Holy shit. That was a lot from those golden rats. Alright, what about if we break some of this stuff? Is that a pipe? I think that is a That's a pipe. Yep. Where's that put me? Up here? Oh, oh, up there, okay. But also, I now see that there's a uh, treasure chest up there, and it appears that there's the remnants of a ladder. And that's probably a, uh, probably a, um, gem, if I had to guess. No, oh, nope, literally just a big pile of cash. Ghost, goddamn. Goddamn hillbilly ghosts. All right, so I can turn that off again. I see a gem up there, uh, that, okay, well, I can go through here to get the key. Oh, I see, and then I go through this other one to get up to the gem, presumably. The gem, which is, like, wrench. Oh, nope, never mind. Or do you think that... Depending on how this is, changes how these go. Nope. Alright, maybe there's a ladder that's invisible. You've yet to grill burgers in the snow deck? Like, come on. You haven't done any snow grilling? It's like the greatest joy in life. What the fuck? I don't like how Guiji just kind of slides at the camera. Hold on. Let me do that again. Also, it looks like I can... Whoop. Wait, I assume I can't do- oh no, Luigi can't control the camera. Usually default to homemade pizza. Um, hmm. Is 
So if these pipes just connect to each other... Wait, hold on. That pipe connects to this one, but does this one connect to that one? Yes. Just wanted to be sure of that. Okay, so there's gotta be another pipe somewhere else. little charcoal girls and put them up against the snowbank like as a table okay what am I oh hello oh that's just a okay didn't realize that that was just fabric I had like bumped into that before Okay, so then if that's... Oh, I see. I can literally just run up over here. Dig a little pit. Okay, yeah. So just get it just the right distance. The minimum distance. Just wanna... Oh. Yeah, I don't think I missed anything else in this area. This seems like a decently sized floor, so there's probably probably enough space for gems to be hidden elsewhere. I like this one ghost who's just got a bucket on his head, like... Oh, yeah. yeah, ice fishing is super popular. I mean, as long as you're somewhere where there's like possibility of actually having ice it's definitely always seems like it's a popular thing come on it's always crazy to see like what contraptions people come up with for their ice fishing huts too because like you see tents it's like boring as hell you see um weird ass plywood sheds you see literal like rubbermaid sheds those like plastic built ones you see people who make ones on like a little trailer uh sometimes you actually just see people who buy cheap trailers and cut a hole in the floor even ones with like wood burning stoves in them Oh, I see. Okay, so now I know what these do. Okay. Hold on. Okay, so... That one goes to the first and last. This is between the two yellow ones. And this one... Yeah, so the middle spot is safe. Yeah, if you can if you can actually just be warm the whole time, then it's basically no different. Well, in fact, it's... Well, yeah, I guess it's no different than regular fishing. I was going to say it's better than, but... I guess 
regular fishing, it'll probably be even warmer depending on the time of year. So I managed to blow a whole lot of cash out of that vent there. The fuck? Okay. I don't think that was how I was supposed to get that bucket, but... Alright. I mean, it depends on the time of year. Depends on how warm it is. But, yeah. Check out this little bathroom or whatever. Fuck that bucket. Alright, what's in this pipe? That dumps me there, and presumably the other one will dump me out at the at the gem there. Okay, so then presumably this is why I do that. this up and get some cash. Just trying to have a look around. Like, it, I see the pipe on the right, obviously. I'm trying to see if there's anything else in here. look like it. Oops. Alright. Oh yeah, Ouija time. Alright. Uh, so we got another gem. How does this... What does this do? Okay, so that rotates that. I would do that. Try to understand like why like this is an l-shaped oh i see because if i, I need to, to be l-shaped to get to that ladder i thought i could act i thought the ladder is more in the middle all right i guess what i'll start with nope that's the wrong way More. So that'll let me get over here. God, it's just like continuous uh, snowblower sounds from outside. Kinda ridiculous. Just like always someone snowblowing. Uh, and then that would let me backtrack if I wanted to, but I don't need to. Wait, hold on. 
Let's do that ladder. Okay, so I guess I have to drop that down. Okay, there's Hillbilly Ghost. Okay, Guiji is fucked. Luigi is fucked, he's dead now too. Too bad Luigi doesn't know how to swim. So this is that. Oh, this is that ladder that I was talking about. <laughs> so I guess it is usable, but only once this area started started flooding. You've gotten yourself into a real mess there, Luigi. Good news, though, the Poltergeist G00 is being tested in depths up to, I forget, really deep. What's important is it's waterproof. But because that ghost used the switch to control the water levels, your path is blocked. I think you can walk along the sewer waterway and reach the switch. Give it a try. You've got to return the water to its original levels and go after that ghost. Wait, why did Luigi just appear? I didn't press the button to summon him. That's weird. Wait, also, hold on. I can't swim, can I? No, okay. Or at least I can't swim there. Oops, that's not the right button. Those, uh... Hold on. Okay, that's what I thought. Those bags of money throw me off every time. Uh... What? I don't understand. What... I made that appear, but like... So what? Oh, maybe I need to flash this. Okay, yeah, there we go. That'll knock this stuff down and then... Uh, or maybe not? What? Okay. I thought it was gonna break that thing up there. Hmm. Can get a thing onto it, but I can't. Press X over here. I like all the pool toys and stuff in there. Okay. Is the point of this just to be able to see the button? Yeah, like, I can definitely attach that there. I still can't get it down, I don't know. these things. 
Nope. Still, it's just to let me look through there. I don't know. Okay. That that thing over the door still seems suspicious to me, but maybe I can't access it until later, or maybe I can access it from, from somewhere up above. ourselves a big pipe puzzle here. Oops, okay. Oh, I, I see. Okay, well, step one, they want me to go do that puzzle, but I'm no fool. Wait, hold on. Oh, I, I guess I wouldn't be able to. I was gonna say... Wait, I'm not hitting the right button. I was gonna say I should pop through this grill with... Guiji, but I can't even deploy Guiji. Okay, so now we can deploy Luigi. Send him through here. She gets us there. I can't go to the right, so I have to go here. Hold on, though. Just let me just pop back there, because... Duck saving the day. Because there's that yellow thing up in that pipe up there. Is perspective failing me wildly here? Is that pipe like much further out than than appears. Oh, or maybe going through here will just knock that out. Works at a far greater range than I realized it would. But also, I think I can actually just walk over to the right here. Oh, and I guess I can pull on this ball. Yeah, I can actually go over to the right. Oh no. Wait, what did that actually do? Oh, I see. Then I can go through here. Get a big pile of cash and stuff. Fish pieces, maybe? I'm not sure what those other things are. I'm like kind of jammed against the wall and it doesn't let me fully turn. Trolls in this rubber duck are really strange. I guess they're, I guess it's, 
I guess I was misunderstanding the controls. It's actually, I was, I thought I just was turning left and right, but it's actually, if I press like down and left, I face to the down and left. Oh shit. more simple than I thought it was. Oh, I see. Uh, okay, so what's down here? That gets me to this area. Well, it was, it's weird because, like, the controls seemed like they were just rotation controls, but it turns out that they aren't. Oh, I can't just jump down there. Also, that was weird, because, like, it took an amount of time to get there. Like, I couldn't... Get to that, uh. Couldn't get to that spot where the coins ended up any faster, I don't think. Not used to adjusting to 2D controls. Yes, yeah, so I'm, I'm too stuck in the virtual world. Is that gonna just put me straight in the water? No, okay. Uh... Shit. Okay, what am I... Fuck it. It's act I would actually prefer rotational controls. These controls are weird. that was spiked. Oh, I guess the other ones weren't. I could see spikes on the sides, but I didn't... I didn't see the ones in the middle. Okay, so I go across... With this pipe. You lose the duck, you lose the game. Yeah, pretty much. Oh, I see. And the other... The other factor to all of this is that... There is a current moving that direction. over this way. Oops, shit. Well, maybe not a big deal. Jesus, how long is this area? Okay, well, whatever. Let's get back over here where we can Ouija back up there. Oh, weird that he just, like, automatically respawned there. Uh, okay, so there's two pipes. Go through this one, which is slightly less visible. I 
like how someone is clearly just flushing like tons of these paper boats and rubber ducks down the drain. Oh, what the fuck? Oh no, I wanna I wanna suck, not blow. Oh fuck, wrong thing. Oh god, oh my god. Oh what the fuck? I don't understand what's like was the current stronger there? It was not working. It was working really weirdly, like There's a spot under here. No, but it was like... <sighs> no, the current is way stronger here. current is actually much stronger. That's why this uh, fishing line is here. Because that gives me something to anchor onto. Oh shit, what? Okay, well. There we go. Oh shit. Um, oh, motherfucker. I was trying to figure out the, the right button. It's A is the button that I was looking for. Ah. Oh. Okay, well, at least this isn't actually that difficult. But no, this does kind of blow. Hey, council, how's it going? You in an airport? Dallas. Well, at least you've made good time then. Do I just need to avoid these guys? Is that maybe all I need to do? One and a half hours until boarding in the former rest of Portland. Not bad. You're almost there. <laughs> oh, we're getting electrocuted. This is where Luigi dies. Hillbilly Ghost is gonna murder us. You haven't slept, so it's more just regular tiredness. Oh, this isn't even Hillbilly Ghost. Oh, wait, except there's definitely... Hey, what are you doing? Ah, that's a problem. Okay, step one, let's kill these mini red boys.
Oh, shit. Um. Oh, I guess I can always just bounce. Like, wait, am I fucked because I can't do Ouija? He'll die as he lived, electrocuted in a shallow pool of water. Okay, so that gets me up here. So then if I wanted to go a different way, I assume I would just divert that and then I... So if it goes... Oh, okay, yeah, I do need to divert them up there. Oh, shit. Do you want a third big pretzel? Got a few words all? I mean, it seems like probably a good idea. Alright. Oh, and then I need to switch this back. And there we go. Now we get to flip the switch back. Uh, we get to flip the switch back. In an airport in America. Love that giant Good toilet time. bowl draining thing sound. Very plumbered. <laughs> Alright, the water's back to how it was. Go back to where you came from and get after the mechanic ghost. That's what I thought. I was expecting a gem out of that, maybe. This flight was among the worst international ones you've been on. Not terrible, but definitely not up to your standards. Yeah, I'm curious in what way it wasn't up to your standards. Was it, yeah, cramped? Bumpy as hell. Oh shit. Is another one gonna fall down? Because I could definitely have blown through this wall. If I had done that right. And the American crew slash company. that like that buzzed the hell out of my controller when I when I picked that up ah uh, they were just being cheap
Damn, I clearly missed blowing up that wall with that mine. Okay, maybe if I go back into this room, maybe the mine will have respawned. Nope, alright. So what happens when you get- oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh wait, maybe I can just, uh... through there. I am wondering. Nope. Wow. Wow. I go back up here. Oh, okay. There is stuff back here still. I like these guys. Uh, like flopping around like fish now. Uh, this is... I think this is my third stream of this. Your new apartment doesn't have... didn't have Wi-Fi, I see. Uh, yeah, I think, th I think this is my third stream. I have a feeling I'll probably... it'll probably be like one more stream after this, just based on how we've been progressing so far. What am I even looking at here? See nothing of value in there? Can I Gooigi in there? Oh, or maybe I can... Oh no, that was just to open that up. Well, I can definitely Gooigi into this. But yeah, so far I've been liking this game. I don't think it's as good as the first one. But it's definitely a lot better than the second one. Oh, oops. I think I had already activated that. There's no Hotel Mario. That's right. Like, this isn't bad, whereas I think I think Luigi's Mansion 2 was actually actively bad. Man, I just murdered that fish. Um, how did I deal with these before? Ow, oh, fuck. Your pretzel. Oh, maybe if I, maybe if I uh, gum him up with a, with a Gooigi. All right. Get that pretzel. Trap. Oh, it's got a, it's got a rope on the end of it. Yes. Watch me. This fish is 100% alive right now. That fish just broke in half, and his spine came out. It's like a fatality.
Oh, hold on. Ow, fuck, what just hit me? But there's a, there's a grate over here. Pretty great grate if I've got a, I do say so myself. Okay, so that lets me get back up here. Oh, which I guess is just to let me get back. Lying? Why would I lie? I guess that half wall is just there to make you get so you can't go back any further. Oh well, wait, I guess I I did actually go back where I was supposed to. So maybe this was the right thing to do. I wanted to look at the map again. Yeah, like I went around to here and then I wasn't able to progress any further. I was definitely told to come back here. Okay, so then do I just want to go back up here again? Can I actually move that lock? So is there anything over here? Looks like the answer is no. Okay, door unlocked. Spikes around the edge of the room. We got some mines. <laughs> Fucking hillbilly ghost, goddamn. <laughs> Okay, so now it's like, uh, push the other guy. Ow, fuck. Oh, no. Well, oh, wait, what? Oh, I see. Like, there's literally nothing else. Oh, fuck. I know I need to... Flash, ah, oh, god damn it. Controls are so shitty. Like the, 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 I would vastly prefer turning controls. What? What, I'm supposed to bump, oh my god. What? You can't move when you're on the edge. Ah, oh, this is the worst. Okay, well, they just gave me a random part.
Like, why can I not flash him when he's dizzy? Oh, mother... Fuck. Are you fucking kidding me? Oh, this is trash. The controls are not good enough for this. I think that's my first actual death. Oh, well, I guess I also had that. Like, it's stupid, because there's... Wait, what? The fuck? Why is it different after I die? What you want to bet I can... Okay, no, you can't backing those up. So I was gonna, like, just try and vacuum these into him. But you can't do that. <sighs> okay, so... What the fuck? You're telling me I'm not supposed to bump into him? Because bumping into him... Unless I didn't hit him there. But I was pretty sure I hit him at least once and it didn't seem to actually do anything. But the problem is that if you're vacuuming, you're moving, and like... <sighs> oh my god! Yeah, so he doesn't get bounced at all when you hit him. I really wish this had... Like, what the fuck? I need to hit him with... Well, except when I hit him with that one mine... It just seemed to send him spinning. Do I need to vacuum the fan out of his hands when he's spinning? Oh my god. There's like a negative or a positive feedback loop here rather that like you start taking damage and it's hard to stop taking damage because like he'll hit you with the fan which does damage and he also then knocks you into into the wall oh what the fuck okay that is certainly not what I expected to be the solution there? Definitely didn't expect to... Ah, oh, shit, I should have waited. Because now I'm going to have to do the water bit again, almost certainly. Basically, I had to wait until he stopped, and then I sucked his... I was able to, like grab his, uh, his floaty and then shoot him into the spikes rather than bumping, which is pretty clearly what... Oh, does he not have a... Shit. Oh, no, he has his fan still. Oh, 
no, I want that heart. What? What? I can't get the- What the horse shit is that? You can't get the heart when you're in the fucking boat? Well, I figured you would bump him into the boat like a sumo thing. Or bump him into the spikes, rather. No, that was press X to get out, I'm pretty sure. Yeah, that was press X to get out. Oh my god, I'm gonna be hit by the fucking mouse. this shit. Oh, cable's falling over. That is a stupid fight. I don't don't like it at all. I also don't know what I'm I'm supposed to do in the second phase because he doesn't behave the same way. Well, I have the strats to do part, uh, at least the first phase. Also, why is this fucking animation? Okay, never mind. Nope. Yeah. Why is this door animation so long? Uh, oh my god. I can skip the other cutscene, but I can't skip this one? <sighs> I'm gonna die. Old age before this fucking fight starts over. It's like a 10 minute cutscene before the boss fight that's like stupid. <laughs> well, it's not even that you can't skip cutscenes because I skipped the death cutscene. You just can't skip this. You can't skip all the cutscenes. You can only skip some of them. This time I get over here, I suck him up. This time I hold on to him until he stops. Okay, well, he was gonna pull me into the water, so. Phase two. It's also weird because usually you can like take their weapons away from them. Wait, did he just get? Okay, I got like fuck lucky as hell there because he ran into a mine on his own before I'd even gotten into the water. Trying to see if I could blow those back at him. Fuck, 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 fuck. Shit. Gonna get hit by that. Oh, wow. 
Okay, this boss fight, I, I got the hang of it, well, there that time, sort of. But it's still fucking bad. The controls in the fucking boat are just really, really annoying. And like, the physics just are questionable. And the fact, like, why the fuck can you not pick up hearts in the water? That's so stupid. That was like such an unnecessary extra thing. Like, the rest of the game you can use hearts freely. And this time they're like, oh, actually you can't use those unless they happen to be the ones that are outside of the water. They shouldn't drop hearts if they're in the water then, if you can't use the ones in the water. Why would you want a wet heart? It's a good question, I guess. Hold on. First. Doesn't matter if I won, it was still stupid. Still a bad boss fight. That was a badly designed boss fight. Bring <laughs> in any of these. There's also that mine there. Like, is there anything I can blow up with that? Probably blow myself up, that's true. Yeah, just put any button on the top row. Well, to be fair, he's also not putting those in there himself. They are just inserting themselves where they want to go. Wait, how do I actually get out of here? Oh, there was a door at the bottom, wasn't there? Also, why would they have spikes along the top edge of this, like, water pit? That seems like a... OSHA violation. Also, why is there like a sink and fridge and shit down here? In a pit that fills with water. Also, no handrail. At least there's handrails over part of this area. I was gonna say, at least there's handrails in this area. Yeah. Stop squirrels getting in. But then I was like, uh, actually there aren't handrails in the entire area, so. Alright, fuck it, whatever, I don't care. Hold on, let me just look at the map, because it feels like I didn't go into... No, no, I guess I did. I guess there's three levels to this floor. I guess I went everywhere. floor. Yeah, like at the rate we're going, it feels like we'll probably be at the top of the tower by, uh, by the end of the next stream. Tomb Suites. Because, like, we'll probably get through this floor and maybe one more by the end of the stream today. Mario. 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 
So is this a floor with actual hotel rooms on it? Because, like, there has only been one floor. Oh, motherfucker, what? There's only been... Oh, I see. There's a trap. There's only been one floor of this hotel with actual hotel rooms in it so far. Which seems like a bit of an issue for a hotel. Hello, round thing on the wall here. That apparently is nothing. Oh wait, or maybe it's right there. No, that's actually just nothing. Just behind the tapestries. Good place to just keep stacks of cash. Also, think about this. Think about how much cash is just, like, lying around accessible to people visiting this hotel. What the... the fuck? Ah, oh, two for one! Uh, eventually. Boom. Got him. Oh, yeah. Alright, so then if we pull that down, I bet there's a gem behind that. Seriously? Just money? Alright. Oh, yeah, we got a vacuum sand. It's the best. Banana peels? Why are there banana peels in these pots? I have been. I haven't really been intent. I have sort of. I've cleared some of the floors and not others. Yeah, it's a good vacuum. It's got a big vacuum bag. Oh, I didn't realize that was a thing attached to this. Uh, I haven't been like super searching for them, but, but I have been sort of. Must be a Dyson. I guess I have to Gooigi here. Like, I think I've probably been averaging like four or five to a... Probably more like four to a floor. But I haven't really been worrying too much. But there are a couple floors that I've actually cleared out. What the fuck? God, can I? Oh my god. I was just like, hold on. Can I vacuum up all this sand? And the answer is apparently... Ah. That's what about... Yeah, exactly. Yeah, that I haven't really... There was like one floor where it's like, okay, well, I've got five of them. I better just find the sixth one. And even that that one didn't take too long. That was on the, the T-Rex floor. So I'm pretty sure I'm obligated to um, vacuum all of the sand off this floor. Can't argue with the duck count in this game. Yeah, I'm definitely contractually obligated. Obligated. Okay, it's another gem. 
I just hope it doesn't refill, because like it looks like those fans on the side are blowing more sand in. So hopefully it doesn't just sort of refill. Oh, this is definitely the way to do it. What the fuck is that? Fucking get massive quantities of sand doing this. I mean, there's probably not anything anywhere except for like where there's things, but. Definitely required to do this. Yeah, I'll do the edges in a little bit. I'm just trying to cover like most of the area so that I can just do a big sweep along the edges. I don't do it the world will end. I wonder, like, I want, actually, I wonder if there's, like, an achievement for doing this, since they have their little achievement system. I wouldn't be surprised. This is the kind of thing that they would put an achievement in for in, like, a game on a system that has achievements. Now I should just be able to mostly go along the edge here without too much issue. Raises everything in LEGO game. Oh shit, I think that I think it is refilling. You got to do it. If you don't check, how are you going to know? not because that was on a mound but it's an unvacuumable mound Got these little spots over here Fuck, what's with these little spots that I missed? So did I miss a little tiny spot right there? Nope, just weird lighting. Wait. Is it weird lighting? Yes, it is just weird lighting. And then there's the whole other side of this room. Of course. Oh, there's also like a boo statue. Yeah, so like, so here's an example. So, right now, Left rotates me left, like, even if I'm facing this way, left turns me 
counterclockwise. If they had just kept the same controls as from right here in the fucking boat thing, it would have been so much better. I didn't even realize that that was how this controlled, but it makes sense. I guess that's just a beach ball, but maybe there's something we need to do with that. There's also that weird square on the back wall there. Oh, there's even little tiles under here and a whole walkway and everything. That's satisfying. Now, speaking of satisfying, like that is satisfying. Just like sweeping the whole way along here. Man, that feels good. Okay, and then once we've kind of cleared this half, I just want to take that beach ball and shoot this little square that's on the wall and just make sure that doesn't do anything. Wait, hold on. Maybe I should also... Oops. Wow, that's weird. <laughs> I don't like how that just kind of flew like that. So realizing maybe I should just shoot this with dark light just to make sure. Maybe also this spot. Okay. Oh, shit. Did I fuck myself by... By, um... <laughs> vacuuming away the sand? Pretty sure I did. Well, I could probably get it. That the sand will probably respawn at some point, either if I save and quit, or if I leave the room and come back. Probably if I leave just the floor, it'll come back. Yeah. I just first I was like, hmm, let me make sure that I can't do that. But no, I cannot put sand back or use the blow functionality to uh, to get rid of the sand either. Or like move it around. Oh wait, I can? Never mind, it does actually seem to work. But I don't know if I'd be, I'd have to move a decent amount over there. Unless I can blow up from this, which I cannot. <laughs> uh, 
I love that I'm actually losing material here. <laughs> this is not gonna work. <laughs> Whatever, I can just come back here. That's probably just money is the thing. It's probably not even like a gem. <laughs> I mean, it'd be pretty tricky to actually write anything useful in the sand. And by useful, I mean a dick. Or, like, poo. So I'm going to take a much more uh, methodical approach to this other side, I think. I'm going to try and do it in big strips. And I'm going to try and do it from the... I think they count this in how long to beat. I think this is part of the 100%. Just uh, spent a good, like, hour and a half clearing out the sand dunes. Damn it. Oh, hello. Oh, it's one of the money money ghosts. I guess it makes sense. Got this guy down to the one cycle point. Boom. Do, 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 do. All right. So now that that's out of the way, let's keep going along here. So we've got a good starting point. Should be able to just kind of go back and forth along this room now. Maybe not straight to right to the edges. Clean up the edges a little bit later so that we don't have to worry about that too much. this one too. Well, it doesn't seem like it actually has anything in it. The fuck? Out of here. Oh, can I just... What? Alright. Don't care about that one coin. There's a gem in there. So probably along here somewhere there's like a flashable thing. Or something. Or maybe like something that I can pull. Right. 
Getting close. Doing like half of the side now, I think. Roughly. Oh wait, hold on. Can I just... No, okay. Yeah, there's gotta be something that I can like... Interact with, or maybe once I unbury it all. Because there's definitely a gem in its mouth. I'm going to be really disappointed, actually, if there isn't an achievement for doing this. Because it's the kind of thing that's, like, not impossible, but also takes long enough that you have to be absolutely dedicated to doing it. What's in that, like, oasis there? Also, just think about the sheer weight of all this sand. This is on the 10th floor of the hotel. Like, there are tons. Also, well, also just think about the weight of all the sand. And it is on Luigi's back somehow. Um, this is just tons of sand. Like, literal tons. Just the structure required to support this on the 10th floor of a hotel. Just be insane. Also, just like, keeping this clean in any way. That's right, eat shit. Alright, now I just gotta go around and get the big guy. Back to vacuum for a second. Don't mind me, ghost. Just doing my duty. There he is. Doing the important work. This last little corner to go, and also, of course, I can open that chest. Come on, that's it. I think that's it. Wow. 
for any imperfections. If anything, it's going to be like around the edge of this. So yeah, this side is looking good. Man, look at how much better this looks now. Oh, little pile there. Little pile here. Too bad I couldn't clean that up. Yeah, look at that. Too bad there was no reward for actually doing it, but... I get the satisfaction of a job well done, I guess. Alright, I also... Oh, maybe I can... Maybe I can use that boo balloon. Where did it even end up? Here it is. Maybe I can do something with that. Here. Oh, maybe I can reconstruct this even. Yeah, okay. Then its mouth is going to open. Boom. Why is that piece a different color? That's not satisfying. What the fuck? Alright. So we managed to uh, fulfill our contractual obligation here. Wait a minute. That all cleaned up. Oh. No? Really? Okay. Interact with these. Ah, oh, there we go. Alright, into the actual room here, maybe? Hello. <laughs> okay, well, step one. You can see this. A balloon? Yes, it was in fact a balloon. I cleared out all the sand. I did the the perfect job. Cleared out the entire floor. in this room. I can interact with that. Is that a door or a closet? What are those things that fell out on the side? Oh, like little statues.
So I managed to blow out one of these torches. Oh, that makes sense, says Luigi. Down to the boss fight arena. More sand. Yellow. Yellow. You eat your meat. The signal got out there all of a sudden. What's wrong? You fell down a sand pit. A uh, classic trap you'd find inside a pyramid. Luigi, you gotta find an escape route. Watch out for more traps. Okay. Step one. Alright, there's like sandworms. Oh my god, is this really? I have to... Fully... I guess... I thought it was gonna be deeper than that, but okay. Looks interactable. And yet it's not. Wait, maybe blow it? No. Nope. Wow, okay. Weird. That looks like there's something missing there. In fact, yeah, because all these other ones have stuff below them, and this one's just weird and cut off. I guess because it's got chains on the other side, on the sides of them. Like, lock someone up. Oh, or maybe because it's a thing that is interactable. <laughs> oh, am I going to have to blow the sand over there to make a path? they're asking of me. this giant tidal wave of sand I'm making. All right. Oh, okay. I was gonna try and grab that. There, now, Guigi is immune to arrows? Here's the oops shit. Seems like the spiders are a little bit more just ornamental in this area than actually enemies. Just kind of hang out on the walls. Okay, so that's where I'm trying to go. Looks like there's a door overhead. Maybe you can get back to the surface through there. Find a way to that door, Luigi. 
These floors, think about it. There's like multiple floors to this floor on the hotel. So these floors must be like five floors apart each. In reality, like to be able to support the way this, these floors are laid out. Multi-floor floors. Okay, is there anything over this way? There is a room here. Oh, but we got ghosts first. Oh, we got mummies. Well, I guess the mummies are... There we go. Mummies are just ghosts. I'm remembering from Luigi's Mansion 2, which had mummies also. I don't think there were ma any mummies in Luigi's Mansion 1. I don't remember, but... Pretty sure they were just in the second game. Whew. Okay, so we got sand pouring down here. So it looks like I probably... Oh, I see. Oh, I see. I need to make this the weight of an alligator, which is a little bit, a little bit less than. Okay, a little bit more than that. At least that's only one damage. So I guess I need to use sand to make up the. Oops, shit. up the difference. Okay. And then, is it just the one? I'm assuming not. Oh, great. So now I need to do less than that. Maybe just one of these. There we go. Oh, yes. And I need to do an elephant, so I need to do a lot of stuff. Presumably I can just go crazy here. Assuming that's not enough. Oh, it is. Shit, or is that too much? Maybe it's because I was on there. Okay, just a little bit too much. Do I need maybe one last thing? Then myself. I think I'm the same weight as one of those things. Okay, yeah. There we go. Hopefully that's the last one. Oh, yeah. uh, okay, so then I can just interact with that. Yeah, the door's still closed, so presumably interacting with that will unlock the door. 
Like how that thing just kind of went flying there. That's one of three puzzles, I guess. Are you fucking kidding me? at me that seemed to stop working there like the pulling flex at me Maybe now we can leave this room? Oh, yeah. All right. So that's that puzzle. One of three. So if we go to the other, oh yeah, okay. There's one straight forward as well. Let's go to the other side first though. Um, let's pull this down first. What? The nesting doll thing going on here? Oh, but it has a... one of these... Oh, fuck. One of these gem ghosts in it. What? Attached to his butt! Motherfucker. Oh, shit. What did I just do? Oh, god. Oh, weird. I managed to, like... Dodge being murdered there by by being mid ghost pulling. Okay, so that got us our fourth one of those. We don't need that, but grab it anyway. Did I manage to press that button again? Whatever, into this room. One of my Ah, oh, fuck. Oh, wait. What am I actually trying to do in here is the question. Just trying to get up there. Okay, I guess that was the thing that I was supposed to do. Okay, so now we got lasers. Trying to I wasn't underneath that, first of all, but... Was I supposed to blow sand up onto one of those things? 
So I definitely can't do that. I, they don't give you a lot of time to... Oh. Fucking ground pound is not ever the ability that I think of. Why is there a fucking ghost in here as well now? Luckily, I don't give a shit about Guiji. Well, I figured that out. At least. Why does he keep on going after Guiji? Like, who gives a shit? That's a trap, buddy. Joke's on you, I didn't didn't care about Guiji at all. Alright, so that's our next snake in place. Then one more thing to go. Okay. Oh, right, I forgot. You have to make them fall over first. not in any danger. What the fuck? Where did this purple boy come from? Ah, motherfucker. Luigi doesn't feel. He just is. All right. So that room cleared. Let's get this upper room cleared as well. Interesting how like more sand starts piling there. Okay, so that looks like a Guiji hole. There's an X on the wall here. That fucking butthole right on that wall. Poison gas. I've got to find balls to put in the holes. That's not a ball. Oh, is that it? No, that's a triangle. Uh, triangles up here. Why can I? There. Come on. Why can I not? Act? Why is it not letting me? There we go. At least there's healing items in here as well. Okay. 
treasure chest. That's important. Oh, it actually did have a thing in it, so I guess it was important. Uh, let's get it there. So that stopped half of the poison. I don't know if that makes it any slower to damage me. No! Fuck! It changed at, like, the last second. The annoying thing is that that coughing animation actually, like, stops you from being able to aim and stuff. Uh, okay. Health in this corner. Where the fuck? Alright, see ya, Emily. Uh... Where the fuck is the triangle? Is it in one of these pots? There we go. Okay, I guess it was. That'll let it, oh, and there's a heart back there as well. Except, oh, come on, that heart had come out of one of those pots. So that'll close off the pit there, so now that next room will start filling with sand, I assume. And now this room will get filled with ghosts, I also assume. Oh, because there was still a thing on the wall back here, so this will probably get me... Where was it? This will probably get me uh, a gem. There it is. Hey-ho. Hey-ho. I guess I should be trying to make him run into something. There we go. Oh, and it's one of these money guys. Like I'm gonna be able to one cycle them. Yeah. Boom. Oh yes. All right. Is that the fifth gem in this floor? So, we've been able to interact with... So I'm trying to go up to the top... I'm trying to go up to the top uh, left. I wonder if there's anything over here on the right side.
Oh, there's a big boy. Ow, fuck. Ah, oh, what the fuck? God damn it. Flexing at me again. God damn it. Get out of here. I don't know where I am in relation to him. Honestly, I had no perspective. Okay, that's the big guy gone. Where the fuck is the direction that's considered backwards here? Pretty sure I killed that guy on the outside of the room. Alright. Cut our way over here. Head on in. Oh shit. Fuck out of here, spiders. In this one? One coin. Oh, fucking spiders. What? Oh god. Oh god, those ones closed much faster. Okay, well, at least it's pretty generous in just letting me go. And hopefully all those spires are actually dead this time. Yeah, they're, they're all dead, so that makes this much easier. Okay. It's like, oh shit. Come on, come on. There we go. Uh, is there possibly a torch in here somewhere? Yeah, okay, yeah, the torch is inside that barrel thing. Wait, what? Look at a hieroglyphic of Luigi leaning on, like... Oh, hmm. oh maybe it's just Luigi walking. Okay, we're back here again. Is she gonna go outside for the boss fight? Yeah. Into the nicely cleared area. Or maybe the sand wolf come back. Oh, looks like, well, at least the sand's back in the cutscene. But this is a, I think this is a pre-rendered cutscene. I don't think this is an engine. This is not just blowing sand down the back of someone's neck. Terrible. Okay. Oh yeah, all the sand's back. So we should be able to get that treasure. Okay, yeah, so I can slowly whittle these things down. Okay, so, oh shit, 
Okay. And to do that, remember to do that on time. Okay. Oh, oh fuck. Didn't mean to. Ow, come on. What? What? Are you fucking kidding me? I didn't damage her, so... It's just back to the start? Alright, I wanna get these, uh, parts over here. This is a neat boss, at least. Like, this is kind of cool. Really takes advantage of the vacuuming sand mechanic that they've been... Here we go. Okay. And now we get to do this again. Presumably it'll change up a little bit. Oh shit. Okay, wait for those to go. They're not, st oh shit, they didn't get stunned the first time. I didn't actually get hit that first time, but Now they, now they take two hits. Okay. So we should be able to get her on a third cycle here. Be nice to get more hearts somewhere. I like how her face is now like mad. Also cool how it actually leaves like the shock wave of sand. Oh fuck. One more heart in the bottom left corner, it looks like. Okay, so now they're probably gonna take three hits to become stunned. third one has pretty crazy reach. Yeah, the back snakes don't do anything. It is kind of surprising. I was expecting them to maybe... Oh, shit. Oh, okay. I can just do that. Maybe start doing something... Um... Shit. What? At some point, like... Like, during a later phase. Oh, 
Come on. Okay. One. Ow, fuck. Damn it, that's annoying. I'm pretty sure I have to. Oh, well, maybe not. I guess I could just keep sucking the, the sand away. I was going to say I thought I needed to kill the snakes to actually progress. Before I grab that, yeah, sucked her. Uh, I'm gonna. Oh, it's not gonna. It's not gonna change the camera angle until I grab it. Da, 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 da. Da, da. All right, that's the 11th floor button. Uh, but yeah, we're gonna go over here and get this treasure chest now that all this sand is back. I think it would have been funny if all the sand was still gone from me cleaning this floor up. Uh, yeah, I think so too, yeah. Because if you cause if you keep dragging, like if you don't start, you can only do four slams, which is 80 damage. Um, but you can keep on sucking uh, for a pretty good amount of time and get some extra damage that way. You just have to be careful not to suck too long, otherwise uh, they will re release early. And you don't end up getting as much damage. Like, I don't think you can do 80 damage just by sucking. But you can you can get, like, maybe 60. And that was just a little bit of cash. That wasn't even that much. You do, like, maybe 60 from just sucking. But if you suck just enough and then pound... Then, uh, then you get a lot. 140. Alright, so we got that. Can I... If I go here... Okay, yeah, I can see I have five out of the... Five out of the six here. I wonder where the last one is. Oh, right, I forgot about that trap. Oops, I'm gonna step on that again. Hey, Rogue. Your drive is finally over and you were almost involved in only one accident. Nice, so you made it to Toronto? Seems like you made, well, I guess you left at like 2.30 two in the morning or something, so I guess it was still a long drive, but. Oh. Oh, yeah. <sighs> Alright, so that gets us up to floor 11. Yeah, and we had started today on 8, so we, we managed to do two, we only did two floors. Oh, I guess we, we did three floors, because we also did B2. Um, yeah, so we, we made some progress there, uh, but at this point, I think it's the time to call it, um, you're in Toronto, you left at, uh, 3.30 Eastern, okay, yeah, yeah, so, I mean, that's a long drive, it's not surprising, it's a, it's a long drive to, like, that part of the world, uh, from here, at least. So yeah, we're going to stop there for today, um, unfortunately, or Rogue. Um, we're stopping there, I'm going to eat because I'm fucking hungry, and we'll continue this on Tuesday. So, thanks for watching, and good night. Blackout Shades and Dreamer are incapable of closing completely, that sucks. Alright, good night!